<laughs> I was about to deep throw it. That was my first impulse. <laughs> Welcome to our life. <laughs> I'm in the middle of trying to take a new passport photo uh, so that we can go on our honeymoon after I get it renewed. Um, and Lee is being incredibly helpful. Hey. <laughs> you said you could do that. Me. <laughs> Whoa. Lighting. Lighting. I don't think the passport office will accept this. Wow. Looking good, eh? <laughs> uh, has anyone ever taken a good passport photo? That's what I want to know. Wow. My little lighting expert. Is this how we were doing it before? Yeah. This is the same lighting? Yeah. Oh, I think the camera just airbrushes you. Yeah. Unfortunate. Can't you airbrush the photo? They say you're not supposed to. But how would they know? How would they know? I don't know. I know it doesn't matter. I think you can airbrush it. Like, in theory. But I'm I just, just I just like, want a cute passport picture. I can't get over the fact that you just send one in. Yeah. Can you send in a photo of anyone? <laughs> 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 in every circumstance, you're able to come up with, like, this conspiratorial, <laughs> like, workaround. <laughs> like, well, what if? People break the rules. They look break for the rules. loopholes. Isn't that a loophole? You are a very good loophole closer. <laughs> I'll give you that. Uh... Okay, mission accomplished. I got this new red lip as a uh, participation award at this drag show I performed in last night. I like it. It's like a little orangey red kind of situation. The brand is uh, Fluid? Fluid? I don't know, <laughs> but it's nice. Fluid? It's been a whole month since our vote house wedding. And we have one little friend left over. Look at him. He is struggling, but he is still with us. After all this time, the last of our roses. I do kind of feel like it's probably time to let him go, but it is so hard. Alas. We're having our first snow day here in Brooklyn in like 700 days, I heard someone say. We didn't really get any actual snow last year. It was just really cold. So everybody's reveling in this entire inch we have going on now. This is also all that is left of my wedding nail polish. <clears throat> Got some on here too. I think it's probably time to take this off as well. <sighs> Tragic. I'm gonna go brave this snowy day to pick up my passport photos and a couple other things. Oh, my cute little snowman pom pom hat. He's gonna do some sessions and that's that. about to embark on an exciting new chapter of adulthood and visit our brand new storage unit for the first time. I know, enthralling. We've been living in this apartment for over two years and have had a second bedroom this entire time that has mostly been a storage closet. And we are trying to do something about that. Been getting everything together, organizing, and uh, figuring out what we can, hello baby. Oh put into storage to make the other room an actual working office. Exciting. Exciting. January. We should yeah. be hibernating, but instead we're doing tasks. We've been hibernating. We need to go get some fresh air and some walking in. So let's go do this. All these boxes. Wow, it's gonna be so much more room. Goodbye Christmas Garfield, I'm afraid. <laughs> you have to go in your hole for another year. Tragic.
February. We have barely vlogged at all this month. I've been in hardcore hibernation mode over here. Trying to rest, trying to read and listen to music and watch films and just do a lot of stuff to get the echo chamber nice and full of ideas and inspiration. And little by little, making our second bedroom an actual working office. It's not quite there yet, but we introduced this entire new desk setup where my second dresser used to be. Look, we've got this cute little wall of travel, photography, and inspo. Uh, this is part of a burlesque costume um, that I'm working on for a show coming up. Don't worry about it. Um, as are all of these little go-go boots. But yeah, we've got this cute little setup over here. We made this corner into a nice little cushy reading and writing nook. I got myself down to one dresser, which is a feat. Hung up this cute little poster of our wedding venue that my sister got me. Plus my hidden botanics bouquet from the wedding. So cute. Obviously holding up very well because she's preserved. Plus more <laughs> drag accoutrement and Benadryl. Why not? So yeah, we've just been moving things over to the storage unit little by little, trying to make some actual use of our second bedroom and trying to get on a more reasonable daily writing schedule, um, which is a task. Hello. It is February 1st which means it is officially midwinter, halfway between the winter solstice and the spring equinox. So that means we have made it halfway through winter. The first inklings of spring are happening all around us or something. At least that's what I choose to believe. Huh. <sighs> Lee is off uh, doing a therapy session elsewhere. So I'm just hanging out at home with our cozy little cats doing some midwinter rituals. Continuing to clean up the house and the office and getting some writing done. Um, I'm just about to crack into a brand new spec feature script, which is um, something I haven't gotten to do since before the pandemic. Um, I was just finishing up a script when COVID started. And then in the interim, I've mostly been writing on assignment. Um, so this is the first moment that I am carving out to focus on my original works. So that's exciting and nerve wracking, but mostly um, it's cool to revisit the question of what I actually want to be working on at this stage of my life, which is a different answer um, than it was last time I had this chance. So trying to reframe it as an opportunity and not terrifying. I'll keep you posted. <laughs> so long between vlogs that we're going from the first snowy day of the year to the first warm day of the year. But what are you gonna do? Look at this beautiful dude. We just got this new fur blanket from L.L. Bean and Jeremy is having the time of his life. He's been making biscuits incessantly. He was obsessed with this Sherpa hoodie that we had so we decided to uh Treat him to the good life. I mean, and us, but you know, the main objective was just keeping Jeremy happy. We got some cute camping chairs as wedding presents. So we're gonna pack all this up and head outside. We've just been getting in the swing of this new year. Um, we had to dive back into their doctorate program at Columbia. Um, and I've been getting my feet under me with some new writing projects. So, lots of, lots of seed planting. I hibernated winter away and now it's almost time for spring again. I guess that's how hibernation works. We spent the morning, uh, getting our honeymoon itinerary in order for May. 
I did get my passport back in time for our honeymoon, which is great news. Doing my best impression of a Russian spy in this passport picture. As one does. Now we're going to go enjoy this pretty 64 degree day outside. It's practically tropical.